If folks will take your seats, I think we're going to get started. First of all, good morning. I hope everyone enjoyed some breakfast and had a restful night. Um, let me briefly introduce myself. My name is George Durham. I'm part of the Linksbridge team that is helping to coordinate the event this week. Just as background, Linksbridge is a small Seattle-based social impact consultancy that does a lot of work in global health. We've partnered with the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation on a number of initiatives, but also specifically on helping to coordinate and facilitate this year's Teach to Reach conference. So it's a great honor to be here with all of you. Um, I wanted to just address a few administrative items for everyone. First of all, because I know people are interested, there is Wi-Fi available. There are instructions on your tables with the passcode at the top of that sheet if you need to access Wi-Fi. I would encourage you to engage and be present in the meetings today. Um, there will be breaks and opportunities to check email and things, but I know that Wi-Fi is often the lifeblood of, of many of us, so it is there if you need it. Also a note, all of the materials you'll see today in terms of presentations, um, handouts, etc., will be made available electronically at the end of the conference, and we'll, we will point you to a URL where you can download all of that information tomorrow. Um, but just know that, that that will be made available to you. I also wanted to note, hopefully you've seen some of the flyers, we are videotaping these proceedings and there is photography also happening. Each of you should have a media release that you'll need to sign that the team will be collecting um, this morning. If for some reason you object to being videoed or photographed, please let one of us know so that we can try to avoid that. But in general, all of these proceedings are being videoed again, so that we can make available to you all video recordings of the presentations today. Um, finally, I wanted to make sure everyone was aware if for some reason you missed the event last night at which we were able to see some of the posters that were submitted by you all, all of the posters are now on display and available throughout the break area. So I hope if you haven't had a chance, you'll take time to see those. Last night we had eight posters. We actually have 15 that were received, and so all 15 of those posters are available for your review um, to ask questions. And I wanted to very briefly introduce the kind of coordinating event team that helped put this event together, um, have been putting in a lot of effort over the past weeks and months, and I'm going to ask them to stand so that you all also have some faces and names that you can recognize if there's anything you need. First of all, a special mention to Molly Abruzzisi and Amanda Shortell of the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation, um, who have really been the, the, the real animating force and energy behind this conference. Um, and Amanda and Molly, if you'll just wave and, and say hello. Also, also from the foundation and part of the team that if you need anything today, Aaron Cochran, if you'll please stand. Lauren Ballinger, also with the foundation. Heather Ferguson, part of the Linksbridge team. Most of you have probably seen emails from Heather. Robin Schofield, also with the Linksbridge team. Myself, George Durham. I also wanted to mention and recognize Nathan Piankowski and Michael Woodward from Bull City Learning, who've also been very instrumental in organizing the conference this year. So if any of us can be helpful over these next two days, please let us know. If there's anything you need, we're happy to try and help. One brief note, each of you also received a lovely notebook, uh, hopefully when you checked in or this morning at your, at when you came to get your name tag. This notebook serves a couple of purposes. It is an agenda for what we'll be doing these next two days. It's also a working book. We will be using this for a number of exercises that we'll be doing over the course of the two days. Uh, and it's also a place for you to take notes. And so there's information about the speakers, there's space available in the notebook for you to take notes during the presentations and things. More information will come a little bit later today on what we're going to be using the workbook for, but I wanted to point you first of all to page two, which provides really an overview of these two days, if you're curious for kind of a, an overall view of what's happening. And then page 11 is probably your most, most important page, which has the agenda for today's events. Um, so you can, you can look at page 11 and that'll be your, your wayfinder. That's also a good segue because on page 10, you will see a, a brief introduction to our first speaker this morning, Ms. Baylene Mitchell, who is the Deputy Director of Vaccine Delivery at the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation. 
Um, VLANE has a focus on country programs and partnership work that the vaccine delivery team at the foundation does and has been instrumental to this event uh, and to vaccine and immunization training generally and has had a, a number of experiences. She'll, she'll be speaking to us first this morning. Following VLANE's remarks, we will then move immediately to a stakeholder panel that will be facilitated by Robin Schofield. So upon the conclusion of VLANE's remarks, if the stakeholder panel will please come to the podium and take their places. And then following that stakeholder panel, we will then hear from Nathan Piankowski from Bull City Learning. Um, and we will go to that point. I will try not to get up here too much and we can try to keep the, the morning flowing relatively efficiently. Um, but with that, it's a great honor to introduce Vilaine Mitchell and thank you all for being here.